A new man passing by. Life is good. Best I've ever felt. All right, folks. I have no idea what I'm going to film today. Because I don't have any plans. But I wanted to show you what it looks like to walk slash run. Ran today a little bit. A smidge, if you can call it running. Um, 76 degrees outside. And we just haven't had temperatures like that. <laughs> over 80. Feels like it's over 80 out there. Doesn't it? Abby's with me. I don't know. Feels like when you're walking and running. So I only did three miles today. But, um, I, like I said, I probably walk, or I probably ran half mile of it total. But that's not all at once. So, you don't have to run. Like, people are like, oh, I can't believe you ran five or eight. Like, I did eight total yesterday. But that includes, like, just walking around town, around the house. So I walked six miles. But, like, here at the park. But I only... You know, there's an extra two miles just from right there, regular life. You see my tan line? <laughs> it's a different color, different tank top. Also, I won't show Abby's face, but she's wearing, the same color. we're wearing the same outfit. <laughs> she has black shorts on, I have gray shorts on. So we're, we're twinners today, but she's always ahead of me. Like, we can start walking together and she's always ahead of me. So I start, you got way ahead of me at one point. Yeah. So I ran, and I was like, well, I'll run and see if I can catch up to her. I caught up to her. Not quite, because I just, I know you like to walk alone sometimes. But then, I was like, well, okay, I can run. So she got further ahead of me, and I kept doing it. <laughs> I, I'd let you, like, get ahead of me for every half mile. Yeah. So, all right. We're all sweaty. Let's go home. It's been a bit. I have showered, cleaned myself up. I'm on my little veggie bowl. I've already eaten all my broccoli. Working on my protein next, and then I'll finish the other veggies. Um, Ashley was in here. She ate part of an apple. I need to, to eat the last pieces of that before she can have this. We got these Trader Joe's croissant, chocolate croissants, a while ago, and then I forgot about them. And she's been sticking them on the counter at night <laughs> to rise. And um, I cooked them for her this morning, and she came down. But I told her she had to have the apples and she ate something else. I just don't remember what it was. Um, but apparently Abby had a sweet tooth last night, late after I went to bed, because she made brownies. But I'm gonna go and finish my vegetables and my water and my show. All right, well, I didn't mean to aim it at her right when she burped. We're bored. We are bored. I have an Ulta coupon. $10 off your qualifying purchase, and there's no limit. From, no, actually, no, I'm I already getting something from my fam because she forgot to get my birthday gift, even though it's like. Okay, you don't need definitely. to hold people to that. That's no, that's, she held it too. Okay, she held don't worry it. about it. Don't worry about it. Um, so we're bored, and we were kind of making up a, making a plan to try and go occupy ourselves when dad called and said he's coming home from work. He wasn't supposed to work today, it's Friday, but um. One of our staff members needed to take the day off, so he went to work, and they're like, you know what, it's slow enough, go home. So, so I asked him, I said, should we wait for you to go run errands, find things to do? And he says, no, I wanna eat, I wanna relax, and then I wanna work out inside. Cause it's currently 82 degrees outside. And these are our first like real summer heat wave, not heat wave, heat days. So there's no running or hiking or anything for him outside this late in the afternoon. And so he's just gonna work out inside after he eats. So he's like, I'm easily an hour and a half away from like being able to do something and I can't, I'm bored. And when I get bored like this and I don't really have anything else to do, I'm probably gonna sit down and watch TV and have a snack. And I don't want to do that. I'm working too hard. <laughs> and I likely will still come home and have a snack and do something, but I watched a show. Ashley and I have loved watching um, Heartland lately, the new season. So that's kind of been fun. We've been holding out for each other um, to watch that. So I do enjoy doing that. Um, so we're gonna go run a few things, just partially for fun, um, partially because I need to. One of the things I need to do, open glove box. Okay, um, one of the things I, need to go do that I don't want to go do. 
I've been holding it off, but I really need to because I just got a $500 bill from the lab company that did all my labs with my last um, like appointment with my endocrinologist. I believe that's what it was from. I don't know where to put straws. They don't fit. We're gonna, anyway. Um, and because my last two appointments with my doctor have been on like virtual online, um, I realized I haven't updated my doctor's office with my insurance card and I can't, I've looked on my chart and I can't update that information and I forgot to do it. Like when you sign in for an appointment and you like confirm the appointment and your data, I forgot at that point for the last two appointments to update my insurance information. I forgot to do it. I was like, oh, everything's fine. Everything's normal. Cause I always skip past that. <sighs> so they don't have my updated information and I'm just getting all these like bills coming in. I'm like, I need my insurance to cover this <laughs> or at least part of it. So I just have to, you don't know this, but I have to run up to the hospital really quick. What? I have to just go to my doctor's office and turn in my insurance card to make sure I actually have that. Um, I'm a little scared that they're not actually going to take my insurance. So we're going to go do that first. And then you wanted to go to Hobby Lobby. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm and then, money. yeah, you need your, your money because I'm not paying. Yeah, I know you are. So we're going to do the ones that we don't want to do first. And then the ones we do want to do. I need to find my stupid insurance card. Okay, well, coming to the hospital wasn't the easier route. They... My doctor has all my information updated just fine, which is good. That part's good. Cause I do have a virtual appointment in August that I wanted to double check it. But then they sent me over to the lab and they're like, we can't do it from here. And I don't know, anyway. So I just thought maybe coming in person would be easier. Now I have to call the lab and call billing. So. Sometimes Jason always gets on or I get on him because he's like, oh, I'd like to do everything in person. It's not always easier. So in the meantime, this one suddenly has the chance to go and have a play date, but only for the next hour and a half. So she does not get to go to Hobby Lobby or Ulta like she wanted to. And so we'll do that another day. There's a whole summer. There's a whole summer. So we're going to take you over there real quick and then I will shop for an hour and a half and come back and get you because I'm not going to go home in the time being. All right, well, at Ulta, I didn't find what I wanted, but I did get this for free because I had a $10 off coupon. So this was exactly 10, so I got it for free. Okay, picked up my sidekick and we made it to Hobby Lobby. Daily, come here because it's 30% off furniture. She doesn't need furniture. She doesn't have furniture. Speaking of Kaylee, someone suggested we do a little Amazon wish list for her for back to school. Usually you do that like after they graduate. Hang on, Ash. Um, after they graduate from high school and they're going out to college and do a little wish college wish wish list type thing. We're we're a year out from college from her graduation, so she's created a wish list. I'm gonna put it in the description down below if you guys want to help. Um, some of the simple supplies that she needs to go off to college, you are more than welcome to help her, not obligated to, at all. This was a suggestion from one of you, and Kaylee thought it was a fun idea. So, that enough. Okay, well we didn't anticipate finding fake Crocs here for $7.99, <laughs> and then like, cute little giblets. She but I want her to get these ones. Really? She won't get these ones, they're so, so cute. So you summery. I don't wear Crocs. Okay. I don't. All right. The rest of what we got are some tacky. What is this called? Tack tape. Yeah. It's just, so it's, it's for new pictures. For yeah. It's gonna use be used on the walls when we trade rooms. And then I found this. I just I can't resist you guys. <laughs> Jacob loves mustard and Kaylee loves ketchup. So they got a cute salt pepper shaker too. Um. And then I found these cute guys. If you've watched my 4th of July videos in the past, I have big trays that I take for the 4th of July with all our corn dogs, which I plan on making this year. But then I thought, that's kind of cute. And we are going out to our friend's house for the 4th, I think. So far we are. Um, and so I think I'm going to text her and tell her I've got, I mean, well, they'll need plates too. 
but I will bring those. I thought so those cute. are kind of cute. It's so that cute. is cute, actually. You see? Little giblets. Fake giblets. <laughs> um, but now I kind of am in the mood to like pull out the 4th of July stuff and see what I, I've got so much stuff. Probably need to donate some of it before the 4th so that like it actually will go to use with someone before. So while it is still 88, 90, it actually hit 90 degrees. Holy moly. Like summer's officially started yesterday and we're already 90 degrees. It didn't officially start yesterday. Yeah, the official first day of summer was yesterday. When did we get out of school? Well, it doesn't, you, it doesn't count you. It's just the actual like national first day of summer was yesterday. You've got a little dot right there. What is that little? Anyway, we just go straight from 60 to 90. It's just like, all right, we're gonna do summer here in the Northwest. So I think we did pretty good. They're so easy to put in, they're so cute. So I don't have to wear mismatch. Yeah, let's show them what you're wearing right now. White a one white one and a blue one. That's literally the only reason why I was willing to get these fake Crocs because she's been walking around for weeks now wearing so her nasty tennis shoes and mismatched Crocs. So there you go. No, We're just trying to find um, the right tennis shoes to get her. But for right now, Crocs work great because she can run around at her friend's houses and around town in them and at, and the lake. We are hoping to start our lake days, our beach days, before everyone like hightails it and go on vacation. So, including us, uh, not, We're not, going on not going on vacation. Yet. <laughs> No. We, we might plan a, a thing in August. Once we know when Abby's surgery is, we could plan like a weekend, go out to the coast kind of thing. Or not, or I would be willing to wait until um, to go to Canada. Why go to Canada? When Taylor Swift says so we can go to the concert. Like go yeah, outside we're not, the concert. We're not going to Taylor Swift's outside concert. Outside the concert. That's what I'm no. saying. No. Oh, I see what you mean. People do that. I would do that. They do do that, but... I don't, and we all have passports, we could. But I think what I'm gonna do now then I can hang out with my best is gonna go home and pull out my 4th of July bucket. We will do a dedicated 4th of July decorating, show you all of it once so it's done video, it's because make... I think that's fun and it's searchable. Um, and it will give me something to do tomorrow as well. So I don't know if I'm gonna decorate today, but I'm definitely gonna pull stuff out and then um, see what, Jason was waiting to see if he could go on a run and exercise today, like since, he, since he's been home, it's only gotten hot, hotter since he's gotten home. It's only gotten hotter. <laughs> so I don't know how long he's gonna have to sit at home waiting. He, I'm just gonna Did tell you him. just go to the community center? No, because he technically doesn't have a, like a membership. You don't either. I don't know, but when you're practicing at the community center, I'm allowed to be there. Oh. That's the reason why I can walk inside on Wednesdays. When you're there, it fell off. Where did it go? she got a little necklace too with her initial on it. it fell off. All right, let's go home. Let's see. It's five o'clock. I'm not hungry for dinner because I ate like at one, one or two o'clock after I went walking. Um, I had all those veggies and stuff, so I'm not really hungry. And I'm J Jason already ate. You probably need to eat. All right, I'll show you what I've gathered up out here. I'm not gonna do more than this because it's been hot here in the garage. You open the garage for just a second so you have better light. Okay, here is the 4th of July box. I don't know if I'm going to use like these uh, pictures right here, but those were what's left in the box. And then I have a bag of stuff. It's not like organized at all. But I'm going to see if I want to display most of this stuff right here. And then I have my pinwheels. Um, these are the ones from the original... Um, memorial of my mom. My friend surprised me and put them out on my yard. So I finally found, actually I knew what these ones were here, um, but I knew they were 4th of July. And then these were the ones I bought from Target that I love. And then, surprise, surprise, underneath those at the bottom of the bucket were these guys that I wanted at the beginning of the summer. So when I pack this all away, I'm gonna put them on the top. Cause this is the only summer bin that I have now. So that's gonna go on the top. See here the little trays that I have. I keep them covered so that I can use them this year. I don't know why they're here, but they are. Um, okay, so I'm gonna leave this stuff out here. I'm not gonna do it today, because I am super hot. 
but I do have kind of a donate pile going here. This is, I forgot to take this last time, but this is all of the stuff that I am not using anymore. I've got these little blocks um, that say America on them, but it's the wrong color of red for me. And I just keep leaving them like in the bin thinking, oh, I'll repaint them or it's just not gonna happen. And I don't wanna have to redo the vinyl on them. So there's just a bunch of stuff in here that I'm just not gonna use anymore. So I'm gonna see if my friends want that posted online. Otherwise, I'm going to donate it. But look at... I have been out in the garage for maybe 10 minutes. I have a podcast going. No, I have a book. I found three new books to listen to, including Rose Code again. I tried to start it probably about a month ago, and then I forgot to listen to it because I couldn't get into it. Um, but one of you, Lynn, you were like, Dana, get back into reading it. So I re-upped my... Um, uh, have it, have it on hold with the library so I'm, I'm waiting for it to come back but I did book or I did um like get two more books on uh, my library account totally distracted there but I'm only 10 minutes into this book that I'm listening to and I've been out here in the garage I should have just opened the garage door it's not that much cooler out there but I am like literally sweating sweating buckets. The only thing of 4th of July that I'll show you that I have done is out in the backyard. Normally I do these inside the house, um, but really not really a huge fan of red. So I tend to not do much here in my front, in this room in here. I don't do much 4th of July. I tend to just do it on the front, like shelves and stuff in my front room and the front table and outside. Um, so I thought these would work way better out here. So people are going to probably be mad at me because I took the couch cushions and put these little covers on them. I made these years and years ago. Um, and that one I just put on the regular cushion that goes on this couch and then that one there. And then I have this little tray. I have another basket. I'm trying to decide if I want the basket or this little lazy Susan to go out here. And then I will decorate this and put some useful things out here um, to have out ongoing. I think we have the bird. My, my battery's flashing, but I know you hear me out here. I know. I'll get Chelsea. Let me get Chelsea here. Mur, 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 mur. Hang on. Chelsea, do you want to come let her out? Chels? Oh, come let Dot out. Oh, there's a spider on there. Gross. All right, so I don't want to get, I'm, I literally have sweat dripping down my back. <laughs> so gross. I don't want to sweat again today. I've already showered. I don't want to go to bed sweaty, but I'm going to wake up even earlier. Actually, I woke up early this morning. I just didn't roll out and go walking because I was waiting for Abby. She's like, I don't want to go at nine. But when she felt the heat today, she's like, let's go earlier tomorrow. <laughs> so we're going to get up earlier and actually go walking in the morning. And so when I am sweaty tomorrow morning, I will de uh, finish decorating and doing this kind of stuff. So stay tuned. Um, hopefully I'll... Okay, battery's gone. I have zero plans tomorrow. Stay tuned. Fourth of July is coming. We are officially in summer. Take care. I hope you guys had a great day. I have third time. Take care. <laughs> Good night. I'll see you next time.